All right, so real talk, outside of the summons that I get to do, these are probably my favorite videos to make during these anniversaries because it always gives me a chance to deliver some good news to you guys and make you guys happy, get everybody really excited, which obviously makes me feel great as well because every single time I make a top grossing video and I have to tell people that we're probably not going to be getting top grossing stones, I kind of feel like I'm letting you guys down, you know, but this time it's not the case and you can probably tell by that intro that things are going very, very well in the global top grossing department. So as of right now, it is currently about 1 p.m. Eastern time, so roughly uh, 14 hours since the LR MUI Goku and LR SSP Vegeta Dual Dokkan Fest banners dropped on the global side of the game. And uh, we're going to go through some of the top regions for Dokkan and see how things are going in terms of uh, top grossing rankings and obviously how we're looking for you know, top grossing rewards and top grossing stones over the next couple of days. All right, so with all that said, let's just jump right into it. We are on the Center Tower website. We are filtered by July 9th, 2021, which is today. All categories, which is very important. You can't just do games or puzzle games or whatever because that doesn't count. You have to be number one among all of the apps in the store and the iOS store. So starting with the US as the first region, as you can see, Dokkan is number one, top grossing in the United States. So that's one region down. Now moving on to another very popular region, France, Dokkan Battle, number one, top grossing. After that, we have Luxembourg, Dokkan Battle, number one, top grossing. Uh, Hong Kong, Dokkan Battle, number one. Uh, Belgium, Dokkan Battle, number one. Spain, you guessed it. Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle is at number one, top grossing. We have Italy, Dokkan Battle, number one. Germany, Dokkan Battle, number one. Portugal, also number one for Dokkan Battle. Uh, and then that's it for now. Okay, so, so far we have, as of recording that is, Portugal, one, two, Germany, three, Italy, four, Spain, five, Belgium, six, Hong Kong, seven, Luxembourg, uh, eight France and nine the United States. So nine regions currently at number one top grossing. And I'm sure there's gonna be quite a few more that follow because outside of these regions that are already number one, we have Switzerland at number two, we have Macau at number two, we have the Netherlands at number three, we have Great Britain at number three, we have Slovenia at number three, and we also have my country of Canada surprisingly at number two. So I think we have a decent chance here for Canada. Uh, we did hit top grossing last year for the anniversary. So um, after this video, I'm probably going to go buy a couple more stone packs, buy all those ticket packs in the Pilaf's Trove, and uh, get us there. So I got you guys. Um, but no, in all seriousness, we are doing really, really well, guys. And unless they make any major changes to the top grossing system during anniversaries, what we can expect as a global player base over the next couple of days is to see this beautiful image appear in our games, obviously with UI Goku and Vegeta as opposed to Blue Gogeta and Vegito from last year. It's gonna say tons of thanks, sixth anniversary, first rank, and come get Dragon Stones. And we should, we should all be getting a hundred Dragon Stones, just like last year, just like the year before that, and maybe for the third anniversary as well. I'm not sure, but at the very least, I know that for the fifth anniversary and for the fourth anniversary, we got 100 stones for top grossing and also some other nice rewards on top of that, like some Hercule statues, some anniversary coins, some story keys, and also a bunch of orbs of different types. And then we also last year got a second top grossing for some additional regions getting top grossing. So after the initial 100 stones, we got a second top grossing because there were uh, three more regions that hit top grossing a couple days later, and that was another 30 stones and also some different orbs as well. So I'm not sure about the second one. I can't promise that, but what I can promise, okay, not promise, it's not 100%, but what I can say with 
very high confidence, okay, like 90% certainty is that we're definitely going to be getting a lot of stones for top grossing. It should be, it should be 100 stones plus some other nice rewards. So yeah, look forward to that, guys. It's going to be awesome. For those of you that got shafted, um, you know, in your summons last night or this morning, don't you worry. We still got a lot of stones coming up. These 100 stones will help, but we're also going to be getting more events and just other ways like social media campaigns and stuff like that to get more dragon stones so uh you know hope is not lost yet okay and i guess that's all there is to say guys finally some positive news for these top grossing videos um i did say before that i'm probably gonna stop doing top grossing updates for like non-special celebrations unless we actually hit top grossing for a regular banner like for videl or something like that but uh, outside of anniversaries, outside of, you know, dual token fest or just major banners like the Tenabata or Thank You Celebration banner that's coming up, uh, I'm probably going to stop doing top grossing updates because recently it's just been like, no top grossing guys, sorry, no top grossing, we're number 30 in France right now, so there's just not really a point, but it's always fun to do top grossing updates for stuff like this because we're pretty much guaranteed top grossing when it comes to anniversaries when it comes to the download celebration and a few other major events throughout the year right so uh yeah this was fun hopefully you guys enjoyed it hopefully it was fun for you as well and um you know what this was completely unplanned but just to celebrate our great achievement for hitting top grossing in so many regions already we're gonna do some quick sixth anniversary ticket summons because i'm probably not gonna do a separate video for it anyway so might as well just uh get a few of these out of the way right now and it would be pretty awesome if we can pull an lr <laughs> in this video just randomly probably not gonna happen i don't expect it but uh you never know man oh oh screen crack okay that's a good sign but you never know i'm feeling pretty good right now i feel like there's some luck in the air i don't need that topo but he is very good let's do uh let's do like three or four multis at least let's test our luck just a little bit by the way for anybody wondering what the exact time we'll get these top grossing stones is i'm not a hundred percent sure but if i were to guess i would say hold on <laughs> no freaking way! <laughs> oh my god! That actually happened! That actually happened. Okay. You know what the best part is? I actually could use him. I don't think my Rose and Zamasu is rainbowed yet. Like, out of all of the OG LRs, they might be the only one I still need. <laughs> Hold on, one sec, one sec. Um, okay, okay. Uh, what do I do again? Hidden potential. <laughs> Attack, tech, extreme. Dude, that was the last copy I needed to rainbow them. Yo. Okay, I... This was really unplanned. Like, wow, okay. Okay. I don't know what to say, guys. I don't know what to say, um, but as I was saying before, you know, I don't know exactly when the stones are going to drop. If I were to guess, I would probably say it's Friday today, right? So Sunday night slash Monday is when we can most likely expect the, uh, the stones, the top grossing stones, that is. But dude, we just rainbowed an LR out of nowhere. Oh, feels good. Okay. You know what? These guys, even though I don't use them too much these days, I feel like they deserve a level 5 attack. Okay? Just because of that. Like, just because of what just happened. And eventually, they're going to get that easy A. They're going to be amazing. So, screw it. They deserve it. Um, let me do one more. Let me do one more since clearly there's something going on here. Right there. There's something in the air. I don't know what it is. I was just talking some BS before, but apparently I was right. <laughs> Apparently, I was right. Okay, Super Saiyan 1's not a good sign. 
Uh, I, I think we might have used up the luck. Okay, there we go. We're gonna end it there. But but guys, um, crazy, absolutely crazy. As always, if you guys liked today's video, make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here until next time. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.